Hello friends, welcome back. Uh, we are so excited to get started together with our first module. So uh, by now you should have uh, all of your materials that you need. Uh, I, I, I wanna hear from you a little bit about your, uh, your, your guitar experience, what you're, what you're looking to do with guitar, all that good stuff. So make sure that you uh, posted that uh, if, if applicable. Um, and then we've already made a commitment to learning. So make sure that that commitment stays strong as much as you can. Okay. Uh, and then lastly, we, uh, we, we talked a little bit about how to practice. So in our time together, we're actually going to start putting those principles into practice, our principles of practice into practice. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. Today, we're going to talk about how to hold the guitar. Now, you might think to yourself, well, you just hold it, right? Um, yes, kind of. Um, <laughs> but uh, but somebody who, you know, has never held a guitar before, and maybe, maybe you have, maybe you've held it plenty, I want to give you a couple tips. I want to give you a couple tips about how to hold the guitar, how to maybe hold it better. Uh, that might be helpful for you. Um, but uh, but I, I'm just going to speak to you as if you've never held a guitar before. So let's jump right in. All right, so what we're going to be covering, how to hold a guitar. So um, the thickest string of the guitar should always be at the top in all circumstances, okay? Um, now, let me just give you a couple things to think about. 90% of guitarists are going to have uh, their right hand over the large part of the guitar. So let me show you what that looks like. Right hand over the top of the guitar, okay? The other 10% are going to be left-handers. But uh, for me personally and, and, and for my students, I recommend that even left-handers learn right-handed. Uh, it doesn't really matter too much which hand is dominant for you uh, in writing or in opening doors and so on. But... Uh, because because when we're playing guitar, uh, both hands are going to be doing two separate things, and um, and your left hand is actually going to be setting up some things that your right hand is going to be expressing. So uh, so both hands will get plenty of use. Trust me. <laughs> so uh, but and the other the other factor too I just wanted to mention was left-handed guitars are kind of rare and expensive. Um, so you know if you can even if you're a lefty, go ahead and put that dominant hand to use uh, by by moving it over here towards this side of your guitar um, and then put your right hand to use and you know it, it'll feel natural to you it won't really feel strange so promise over time as we work okay all right so uh like like i have here uh, pedagogy is going to be the exact same no matter what uh no matter which way you 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 know hold your guitar if you're right-handed left-handed uh, let's just go ahead and put the thickest string on top all right so let's get into it how do we actually hold the guitar so step one uh we're gonna have good posture okay so we're sitting upright. You notice both my feet are flat on the ground. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to wrap my arm over the top of the guitar. Okay. And then I'm going to place this little curve on electric guitars. It's going to be the exact same. There's a little curve underneath usually. Uh, that curve actually is meant to sit really comfortably in uh, on top of your leg. So go ahead and put that curve right on top of your leg. You know, don't put it in between here. Or don't put it over here on the left side. Go ahead and put it over your over your right leg and wrap your arm across and around the top, okay? All right, the next thing that we wanna do is we wanna make sure that we pull the guitar in towards ourselves. So we don't want our guitar laying down. We want it, we want it pulled in towards ourselves, uh, pretty close, okay? Uh, and that's gonna be really, really helpful as we, as we play. Now, the last thing that we wanna do, just to give a little bit of support for now, is to use our left hand to hold this long part of the guitar. We'll talk about the parts of the guitar um, uh, later, but. But for now, just go ahead and support your guitar with your left hand, okay? All right. Uh, so we talked today about hold the guitar, how to hold the guitar. Uh, that thickest string is going to be on the top. You're wrapping your arm around that that uh, that little curve right there is going to go right on your right leg, uh, and you're going to pull it in, pull it in close to yourself. All right. All right. The next thing we're going to talk about is you guessed it, parts of the guitar. All right. So action items for our uh, time together today. We, wanna, uh, we, we don't want to practice this until we get it right. We want to practice until we can't get it wrong. So make sure that you're holding your guitar uh, uh, and, and practicing it until it's similar to me. It's easy for you and you can teach it to someone else. All right. All right. Keep on moving to the next lesson uh, whenever you got this down. See you soon.